What's up guys? It's me Lair Sam. Welcome to my channel. Where in the world am I today? In the middle of nowhere. I am in the middle of Maharashtra and Goa heading to Goa by road by this bus you see right here. It's this beautiful girl with me. Yes, so this time we took the bus because uh, it's December, peak season, yeah. always expensive. Yes. And then we forgot to book our tickets. We forgot to book our tickets in advance, so flights got really expensive, and we didn't want to spend that kind of money on just you know going to Goa. So we thought bus is the best option. I actually like bus journeys because somehow it's it's just fun, and this is a sleeper. So uh, yeah, it's a pretty great bus. Yeah, it's not it's not a sponsored video by the bus. I'm I'm like. Uh, telling you guys that but it's it's fun and I've done this quite a lot and especially during the month of December is the best to travel with uh, you sleep in the night and you reach in the morning but although we are a little late I think our bus got yeah. a little uh, yeah. delayed in case you've never traveled by bus and are very skeptical about it let me show you what this looks like so if you are ever planning to travel by a bus you can take this one it's very clean very neat let me show you this is our spot and uh, as you can see there are plug points even to charge your phone and uh, place to keep your bags that's pretty much it about how the place looks like we are right now inside the restaurant and uh, you know where usually the bus stops and you can order your food and uh, I don't usually feel like eating anything from these restaurants but uh, just getting some bread and omelette and what what are you going to have Shraddha? Chai! Are you sure chai? How can we skip chai? Chai is everywhere. That's the best part you know. If you're a coffee person, you can't have coffee everywhere. Yeah, if, you, if, you're, yeah, if you're a chai person, chai is everywhere. almost everywhere. What's the food like here? What is this place called? Chai Prasad? Dhaba. And I think every Goa, uh, Mumbai to Goa bus stops here. Having some bread and omelette, I think that's the safest to have. That is pretty good. How can bread and omelette go wrong ever? Hello guys, we are inside the bus, chilling. Like I said, it's enough space yeah. to sit down and hang. And uh, it's better on the uh, lower berth, but we usually prefer the upper one always. Yeah. And uh, what are we doing now? Are we playing some game? Why not? We don't one have hour away from the destination. Although we don't have any games. But yeah, one hour away from the destination we are right now around South. Alright, now since we are uh, approaching our destination, I just want to like get a little presentable with my face and uh, not look so sleepy. There are a few products that you need to carry always whenever you are in the bus, especially when you are in the bus. A lot of toilet paper because you never know how the toilets are. A lot of toilet paper, a good bottle of like drinking water so you can like even drink it and wash your face also with that you cannot trust the water either. Uh, sanitizer, correct? Yeah. Anything else? Oh, mouthwash. I have the mouthwash as well. Also carry your own bed sheet. Because I don't trust these, so I put my own and I use my own. Has anyone ever done this? Uh, get ready with me in, in, the bus. in the bus. Let's do it. Things first, I'm gonna comb my hair. Yeah. <laughs> Washed my face with clean drinking water before, because there was a break right now. And uh, now I'm just gonna use some moisturizer and uh, this one has uh, this one has SPF 30 in it, so it's great. It's the Ole Regenerous Pip UV, and I have I picked this up in London actually, and uh, it's it's in it's in India now, so it's great. I've been using it for quite a long time. I use the other moisturizer as well, the Regenerous. I also am working with them, so I'm actually using this product on a daily basis. Especially when your moisturizer has SPF, it's great. So get this one. So um, 
perfect because this doesn't feel greasy especially if you have oily skin so that might be a concern okay how am i going to do my eyebrows in the past? this is some skill huh don't my favorite lip tint, lip and cheek tint. I'm gonna link it in the description. So make sure you go there and check it out. So very very light. And I'll also link some alternatives. Oh my god, this bus is shaking too much. Look, my cheeks match my t-shirt. Going towards Siddharth's house. Yes. So I'm here at Siddharth's house with <laughs> the one and only weighing 755 pounds all the way from London, England. United Kingdom. Make some noise, and gentlemen. Okay, and okay, okay, enough. Four. My God, what is this room? Such a mess. My bag is really small, so please. That's Shraddha's bag. That's my bag. And uh, it's around five o'clock, and we're getting ready for the fest. So let me tell you the reason why I'm here today in Goa. So there's this thing called the Goa Affordable Art Fest that happens in Goa and I tried my luck and I sent 10 photographs that could be exhibited at the exhibition and from among them one was chosen and it's going to be shown in the exhibition today. Today's the launch, it goes up to the 14th of Feb at the Museum of Goa called The Selected Artist and I will be getting a separate band at the museum and they're going to interview me and things like that. So it's exciting stuff and um, never shown at an exhibition before but uh, it's 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 cool that one of my photographs is going to be there so i am going to get ready right now and wear my most artsy outfit we have siddharth here in this orange suit looking all dapper oh, no, no, I'm not dapper. <laughs> the bed a sick patient i'm not a patient <laughs> She, she's been like coughing so much and even I'm a little sick <laughs> okay so I'm gonna begin with my makeup and oh are you yes I am Woohoo! I'm starting with some moisturizer the same thing that I used today in the morning because you can also use it as a primer and using the Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation. I've been using the Bobbi Brown for the longest time and I'm very fussy about my foundations but this one's amazing. Then I'm going with some blush. This is a Bharat and Doris blusher number four. Oh man, that's a lot. This is the most unaesthetic video I'm making. Come on. But the most real as well. Don't wear a hat. It's very hard. It's a show now. Okay, then wear a hat. Wear it. Not that. Something. You look bald from behind. No, no, something plain if you have. I thought you don't like the beach. I don't Can know. you believe that Shraddha doesn't like beaches? A. She thinks it's too sandy. <laughs> I never say that in the vlog, but depends on the mood. Yeah, she loves the mountains, but that doesn't mean you hate the beach. I right? don't hate it, yeah. It's just very sticky. But that's the beauty about it. Sticky, yeah, right. sticky. I mean, you get tanned and the sand is like in your bum. <laughs> no matter what you do, it ends up in your bum. I don't know how. 
so I'm using my all-time favorite Huda Beauty palette for my eyes it has a lot of beautiful shades take it easy guys take it very very easy and always remember Huda Beauty she the beauty <laughs> I am so sick today I got my period on the bus, like on the freaking bus. Can you imagine? Can can you can can you imagine how it can how it could how horrible it can be? Like getting your period on the bus, sleeper bus, and then I realize I'm leaking. Ah, disgusting. I'm so tired. <laughs> my stomach hurts. Have you ever seen me like this in, in a vlog? Like I actually look really tired because I am. Quick makeup tip: whenever you want to look like all glam. Especially with your eyes, um, and you don't know what to do, just go with a nice bronze or golden eyeshadow, and then um, don't forget to do your inner corners. That makes your eyes look amazing and glamorous. So this is what my makeup and hair looks like straight hair for today gonna wear my dress now I'm wearing this white shirt and a black and white skirt with pink shoes you're gonna see it's very interesting so I'm all set for the evening Yay. look at buy some painting some art we're gonna buy some art yes. some art buyers for the day <laughs> that's us <laughs> I'm wearing this shirt from ASOS and it's, I think it's very interesting with these studs on the collar and the ribbon. So to match my ribbon, I have the pink shoes and my mini pink bag. Ooh! And all that fits into this That's is, micro. is a spare button for the <laughs> shirt. <laughs> and this beautiful skirt from H&M. I think, I think that's nice. I'm very comfortable. I feel very artsy. <laughs> looking for some stuff to buy <laughs> but I'm, I'm looking for my artwork where is it not my artwork but my photograph so much good stuff here like I don't even feel like looking for my stuff it should be somewhere where the photographs are <laughs> where's my thing my thing my thing where is my thing <laughs> This guy in the orange suit. Oh, there it is. That's my picture. My legs. My legs. <laughs> it's his legs, by the way. To Escobar. You just feel very conveniently taking my phone. Hello, founder of uh, Gaff. Can I have some uh, wine to start off with? Wine of treatable pencil. Are you? Are you? What the fuck? This is how you get treated. Hey, excuse me, I'm selected artist. Talk to me properly. That's what you are not free for you. Alright, guys, if you ever come to Goa, Please visit Escobar, which is in, where is it? Asagao. Asagao. And this is your beautiful host here, who will be there? Always. Always. Delicious! Oh my God! If I have this in my house, I would want to eat it. I would want to eat pav every day. So delicious! Oh my God!
Hey guys, so it's the next day and I'm here ending my vlog because I couldn't do it last night. Um, so the whole vlog was about how we came into Goa, especially during peak season, in the, in the most cheapest way possible by bus and also pretty clean. So if you guys want to come into Goa anytime, like even during peak season, get the bus. Don't have to like wait for flights or uh, even trains because you don't get trains at the last moment. Buses you get every time. Anyway, so that was the whole point. The journey and the day and affordable art fest how it was a big deal for me so i really wanted to vlog it and um, the whole exhibition such good stuff so the exhibition goes on till the 14th of feb so you guys can still come into goa visit the museum of goa and if my artwork is there you can uh, not my artwork my photograph is there you can still watch it uh, pick it up if you want <laughs> and uh, it's still on till the 14th so yes that's about it. That's about the whole vlog. Right now we're heading towards our next stop. That's Shraddha for you. Hi. Trying to ignore the camera very conveniently. Ah. <laughs> anyway, um, th th there's like three more days here and uh, it's going to be amazing because Goa is always a good idea. And thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up and also comment and tell me if you have ever tried the bus or you think flights are the best or you know you think buses are disgusting anything let me know in the comments below tell me about your experience and i will see you guys soon bye